Hello YouTube and welcome back in Flight Sim. We are back in DCS World in the Mission Editor and today we're going to look at how we can make our AI aircraft refuel um, in a mission. So, actually here I've got my tanker set up. If you, haven't, if you don't know already how to set one of those up, there is a tutorial I've made. I will link that in the description below. Okay, so you should go ahead and check that out. And here are the, uh, I've got two F-18s here that are low on fuel after their transit going into the target area and I want them to refuel before they carry on uh, their mission. So very simple, what we can do is go ahead here and click add. I want to add a waypoint. Um, so if we go ahead and click, yep, yeah, number one. So we want to come down across here to uh, add an action. We want the, uh, our F-18s to perform a task and we want them to refuel. Now. One thing to bear in mind is you have to have your uh, refueling action within a certain radius of your tanker, otherwise uh, they won't uh, they won't go and tank essentially. What that radius is, I'm not 100% sure. That's something you have to play about with. Um, I normally try and have it reasonably close to where I know my tanker track is, um, and then they will go ahead and pick the best, uh, the closest tanker. Uh, say if we had another, if we had a KC-135 orbiting next to it as well. Uh, they would go ahead and pick the best one uh, for their mission. Okay, so that's my refueling pattern, and then let's just add another waypoint after this. Once they've really finished, they're going to go ahead and fly to waypoint two. Okay, simple as that. And let's go ahead and uh, check them out, make sure they refuel. So here we are, we're with our F 18, flying with his wingman over there, and they are now heading to the tanker. Well, it's a waypoint one. Once they get to waypoint one, they will then find the nearest tanker and go and uh, refuel from it. Let's just speed things up a little bit so we can get there sometime today. So it goes without saying you can do this with any aircraft provided it is capable of carrying out uh, air to air refueling. If it can't air to air refuel then obviously you won't be able to do this. Um, but thankfully these F-18s should be able to air to air refuel. So here we are, he's picked up his tanker, and you can see it's just on the nose there. And now he's going to fly to rendezvous with it. Hopefully pick him up. Okay. You see our tanker now has the uh, drogues deployed. Uh, you can see our aircrafts are coming in. Now, uh, one thing to be wary of that I've found with it, it's only really capable of uh, carrying out refueling with two, air, two an aircraft, uh, one flight of two aircraft. If you have a flight of three aircraft, what I've found is the third aircraft tends to crash into the tanker. Um, why that is, I'm not sure. It just seems to be like a little bug at the minute. Um, so uh, it's just one thing to keep in mind. And here we are, our uh, F-18s are now taking more fuel. Lovely. So like I said, once they've carried on their fuel, taking the fuel, they'll carry on with their mission. They'll fly to the next waypoint in their sequence, and the tanker will carry on flying this racetrack pattern. I hope you found this uh, little tutorial useful and helpful in your mission planning. As always, please like and subscribe to the channel, it really does help me out. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the uh, section below, and I'll try to answer them if I can help you. As always, and thank you very much. Goodbye.